Hello, hello, hello everybody. This is a video that I've been putting off for a considerable amount of time since the three, four months that I last uploaded. Uh, but I've been pretty busy in this time. I've been c cooking up a lot of new stuff and I'm pretty much just going to show that off today. So, uh, last time you guys heard from me, I released my game 1010. Well, I've released one game of my own since then, and I'm about to put out another one. So the first game I'm going to show you guys is called Calmfall. And it's pretty much about staying calm while you fall. Let's jump right into it. Do, 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 do. All right, so pretty much you're this hexagon and you press play and you have to not fall off of your little tower. So pretty much what I've been doing this year is I've been resolving to be a finisher pretty much. I've been making a point to finish all of the old projects that I had uh, dreamed of or started and never finished because I think it's really important to finish what you start. So that's what I've been doing and uh, these games are actually not going to be the last you'll see of me this year. I'm working on a lot of new stuff both for myself and for other, or with other people so you can probably expect to hear a lot more about that coming up to in the next few months. Do -do -do. You get to tap uh, more blocks for extra points before the game actually ends. Uh, so yeah, and then you can buy skins for your hexagon. And yeah, it's pretty cool. You got the merch shop, you already know. Uh, but yeah, that's pretty much that. There's not a lot of depth to the gameplay here, but it's a game that I really wanted to make for a while, you know, just for myself, and I finished it, so that's what's important to me. Uh, not, not really a lot to show off here, but I'm going to leave a link in the description, both for this game and the next game that I'm about to show you. So this is a game that I've been working on this month. Uh, I worked on Comfall for, I think, the entirety of July and a little bit of June before that. But yeah, I started Cloudbound this month at the beginning at the beginning of the month. Um, or no, I started at the at, at the beginning of August. My bad. And I'm about to release it in like a few days. Yeah, I'm re I'm releasing it on the eighth. I thought it was going to be done by the end of August, but it wasn't. So in this game, you're uh, you're not necessarily a penguin. Uh, bird is the default character, a little cute red burb. So yeah, you're a little bird, and you press Q to move on the tiles, and you press E when you have to jump over a tile. And it's pretty much just a muscle memory game uh, that also likes to test your reflexes. Um, yeah, so the path falls behind you, and it, it falls progressively faster as you um, move forward, and it also falls behind you uh, automatically, depending on how fast you're going, like if you're going too fast for it to keep up with. But at a certain point, it gets really fast, and your movements have to be pretty much automatic, or else you will fall behind. So it's a pretty exciting game. I've gotten really good at it, so that's why I'm kind of breezing through it now. I guarantee you it will not be this easy the first time you play it, however. My high score here is like, I think it's 1,300. It's pretty crazy. So yeah, that's what happens when you press the wrong key, or uh, if you're playing on mobile, you tap the left and right sides of the screen to play, and uh, I might add games, gamepad support in the future, but yeah, you can restart or you can 
go to any one of the different menus here. Uh, I'll go back home and uh, settings here. I actually have a product where you can buy a rainbow path and the path will flash rainbows you move. It's pretty cool. And uh, yeah, the leaderboard. Leaderboard and there are a bunch of badges that you can unlock as well as some of them have progress bars. Pretty cool. And uh, the gems that you collect on when you're playing, they can, you can spend them on characters in a character pack, which is pretty cool. I have three right now. I might add, might add certain themed ones in the future. Who knows? But uh, yeah. And then uh, something for the creators out there. As with my last few game releases, uh, 1010 and Comfo both have this ad system, but you know, if you're a game developer and you want a relatively cheaper avenue to try to get your game seen out there, then you can buy an ad. You just enter your game ID. Let's see if that works. I don't have a game ID on my clipboard right now. Yeah, that errored. Um, but yeah, you enter your game ID and then it'll show you what your ad will look like. It'll display the information. And then you'll get an option to buy a one-day advertisement, a one-week advertisement, or a one-month advertisement. So, yeah, I'm releasing this game Sunday, the September 8th. And, you know, if you want to experiment with that before then, I'll leave a link in the um, video description for you to play Cloudbound and check it out. And you can buy an ad in that shop there if you want. Uh, so thank you for supporting me if you do supporting us both um, but yeah that's that just two small relatively small game releases in the past couple months um, what else am I working on I'm working on a couple of games that I can't really talk about right now um, I've got another couple opportunities coming up that I might talk about soon but that's pretty much the reason why I've been taking a break from YouTube I've had a lot of uh, I've had a lot of personal work and actual work to do. I've just been super busy and I haven't really, I haven't been focusing on YouTube as much as I used to, but that much is obvious. But I, I sincerely love producing content for you guys. I love helping out the community with my videos. I get a lot of messages pretty much constantly from a bunch of you guys asking me, you know, if I'm ever doing YouTube again, when am I going to upload? But, yeah, the answer to that is, I don't know when I'm going to upload more, but I certainly want to make an effort and keep trying to because I love you guys, I love helping you guys out, and I love making content for everybody. So, that said, I guess I'm just going to wrap up this uh, little life update, but if you, if you guys have any content at all that you want to see from me, any specific videos you want me to make, I think that's what I would like to start doing. Just start catering to your guys' comments specifically. And just make whatever videos you guys want me to make. Uh, I, I might try to get on a schedule producing one video a week, at least, like on weekends or something. But, yeah, that's what it, everything looks like for me right now. I would love to update you guys as stuff happens so you know just comment what you want to see and expect more content from me if you guys want to actually keep up to date with what I'm doing uh, in terms of game in terms of game development and my life you can see all my personal projects and some of my upcoming work projects on my Twitter Rathsong HS I'll leave a link in the description of course so I, I guess that wraps it up guys uh, you can also join my group Nightmare Studios, which I'll leave a link to if you want to keep up with my personal projects. Uh, if any of you guys remember my old game Sweet Tooth, I'm re-releasing that pretty soon, either this month or the next. Uh, but yeah, that's all I can say for now, guys. I love you all. I'll see you next time.